Australia's Trade Minister Simon Birmingham hopes that an ambitious trade deal to be signed on Sunday between 15 Asia-Pacific economies will help improve the country's strained relations with China. The China-backed Regional Comprehensive Economic Partnership deal to be signed by the Association of Southeast Asian Nations could become the world's largest free trade agreement covering nearly a third of the global population and about 30 percent of its global gross domestic product. The deal would pro progressively lower tariffs and aim to counter protectionism, boost investment and allow freer movement of goods within the region. Australia's ties with China, its biggest trading partner, became freed after Canberra called for an international inquiry into the source of the novel COVID-19, which erupted in the central Chinese city of Wuhan late last year. This is an incredibly important agreement in terms of the timing for when it occurs. Symbolically, we see huge pressures globally on the trading system and, of course, pressures that Australia faces too. This agreement signifies that our region, which has been the most economically dynamic region of the world in recent decades, is still committed to openness and to trade, and that we will use that as a platform and a springboard for recovery in the post-COVID era. But I welcome the fact that Australia and China have been able to continue as partners in the RCEP agreement. It's an important sign of our willingness to continue to work in regional cooperation and regional economic partnership. Thank <laughs> you.